in the upper-class Los Angeles, California neighborhood of Northridge Appearances are everything the average home goes for hundreds of thousands of dollars So when one property recently hit the market at nearly half a million dollars people thought it must have really been something special Just about anyone who actually took a look at it. However was stunned by the asking price Far from the typical high society domicile this expensive house was more haunted house than dream house So why was it that the sellers thought they could get so much for this dump? You won't believe the answer This Los Angeles, California house which is located in the swanky upper crust neighborhood of Northridge is currently being listed for four hundred seventy five thousand dollars Anyone looking at it is probably wondering the same thing. How does this piece of junk cost so much? Despite looking like a total pile of trash the seller really believes they valued it appropriately It was built in 1956 and it looks like it hasn't been touched since for better or worse So why exactly do they think they can get almost half a million bucks for this shack? The answer might surprise you that is unless you know a lot about the real estate market of Northridge as they say it's location 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 the Northridge area is actually very upscale and home to many big Hollywood celebrities and stars which means that people will pay a premium to get in on the action the sellers are advertising it as somewhat of a flippers dream but it looks more like a flippers nightmare to us there's some serious work that needs to be done in order to salvage this house this bathroom for instance is like a bad dream that is unless you're staging a haunted house who on earth would want to use this place no one fact it might be more economical just to bulldoze the whole building and start fresh even the appliances seem to be crying out for help they would all have to go and be replaced with new fixtures in that case it would really be more logical to build a brand new home on the property no matter what they plan to do with the space whoever buys this house has a lot of hard work ahead of them for the price that's being asked the new owners would have to be able to totally transform it to flip it for a worthwhile profit then again if you have the money to do so leveling it entirely might be a better option this part of town is typically expensive after all so if you bought it and totally bulldozed it in order to build a new home you could definitely turn a profit it's a risky proposition however as there's no guarantee that any property could be sold and building a new home would be a costly endeavor anyone who wanted to flip it had better have done their research thoroughly Heck the inside of the garage area looks like it's totally decrepit even nature is starting to reclaim it Doesn't this photo just look like a scene from the original Jumanji film to be honest? This is going to be a tough sell Really the interior resembles something out of a horror movie the residents in this swanky neighborhood must be eager to see it gone from their sights Which is easy to understand of course if it remains in this condition any longer it could bring down their property values would anyone be willing to shell out the cash necessary to make this house and space into anything other than a total dump? Only time will tell, but in the meantime, let's all be amazed at the asking price. This house might be worth nearly half a million dollars because of the land, but that doesn't change how unstable the actual structure seems. It's going to need to take a lot of love to transform it from a piece of junk into a gem. Real estate sure is a mystery, isn't it? Do you think this house will sell? Maybe some famous Hollywood house flipper can take on the project and film it for TV. They'd probably have to spend one whole week just power washing all that brown goop off the surfaces.